ವಂದೆ ಗುರುಪದ್ವಂದ ಭಕ್ತಿಂದ ಸಮನ್ವಿತ ಶ್ರೀ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ವಂದೆ ನಿಂದಸಹೋದಿ ಶ್ರೀನಂದನಂದನ ವಂದೇ ರಾಧಿಕಾಚರಣೋದಯ ಗೋಪೀಜನ ಸಮಯುಕ್ತ ಬಿಂದಾವನ ಮನೋಹರ ವಾಂಶಾಕಲ್ಪತರ್ವಶಿಕಿಪಾಸಂದು ಪ್ರವಚ ಪತಿತಾನಂದ ಪಾಪನೆಭ್ಯ ವೈಷ್ಣವೇಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ಮೂಕಂ ಕರೋತಿ ವಾಚಾಲಂ ಪಂಗುಂಗ್ಲಂಘಯತಿಗಿರಿ ಯತ್ಕಿ ಪಾತಮಹಂಗ ವಂದಿ ಪರಮಾನಂದಮಾಧವ ಬಿಂದಾವ ತುಸಿದೇ ಪೈ ಪಿಯಾವೈ ಕೇಶವ ಸಚ ವಿಷ್ಣುಭಕ್ತಿಪದೇವಿ ಸತ್ವತ್ವೈ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ನಾರಾಯಣ ನಮಸ್ಕೃತ ನರಂ ಜೈ ಗುಣೋತ್ತಮ ದೇವಿ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ವ್ಯಾಸ ಕಥೋಜಯೋ ಮುದೀರ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೆ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಕಥೋಪದೇಶ ಗೌರೀ ಪತ್ರಶ ಪ್ರಕಾಶನೆ ಚ ಸದಾನುರಕ್ತ ಗುರುಭಕ್ತಿಯುಕ್ತ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಪ್ರಮದಾಕ್ಷ ಜಗೋದರ ಧ್ಯೇಯ ಸದಾ ಪರಿಭವಗ್ನ ಭವಿಷ್ಠದೂಹ ತೀರ್ಥಾಸ್ಪದ ಶಿವಭೈರಂಚನು ತರಣ್ಯ ಭೇತಾತ್ಯಹಂ ಪ್ರಣತ ಭವಾದ್ದಿಪೂತ ವಂದೇ ಮಹಾಪುರುಷತೆ ಚರಣ ಹೃಭಿಂದ ಯತ್ಪಲ್ಲವನ ಕಚಂದಮನಿಟಾಯ ವಿಸ್ಫೋರಜೀತ ಕಿಮಿ ಗಪವಧೂಷ್ವರ್ಶಿ ಪೂರ್ಣಾನುರಾಗರಸಾಗರಸಾರಮೂರ್ತಿ ಆರಾಧಿಕೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಶ್ರೀಯಾದೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರ್ಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಶ್ರೀಯಾದೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ಆಜಾನುಲಂಬಿತ ಭುಜ ಕನುಕಾಬುದಾತ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೈ ಕಪಿತರು ಕಮಲಾಯುತಾಕ್ಷ ವಿಶಾಂಬರು ದ್ವಿಜರೋ ಜುಗಧಾರ್ಮಪಾಲೋ ವಂದೇ ಜಗತ್ಪ್ರಿಯಕರು ಕರುಣಾಭೂತಾರು ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ನಮಿ ಗಂಗೇ ತವ ಪಾದ ಪಂಕಜ ಸುರಾಸುರೈರ್ವಂದಿ ದಿವ್ಯಕ್ತಿ ಮುಕ್ತಿ ದಾಸಿ ಭಾವಾನುಪೇನ ಸದಾ ನರ ಗಂಗಾತರಂಗರಮಣೀಯ ಜಠಾಕಲಾಪ ಗೌರೀ ನಿರಂತರ ವಿಭುಷಿತ್ವಾಹುಭಾಗ ನಾರಾಯಣ ಪ್ರಿಯ ಮನಂಗ ಮದಾಪಹಾರ ವಾರಾಣಸಿ ಗುರುಪತಿ ಭಜ ವೀಶ್ವನಾಥ ವಾಗೀಶಜುಷು ಬದನೆ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮೀರ್ಜಕ್ಷಿ ಜಸ್ಯಾಸ್ತಿ ಹೃದಯ ಸಂಬಿ ತ್ಸಿಂಗಮಹಂ ಭಜೆ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ 
नमोस्तु नाम रूपायो नमोस्तु नाम जलपिने नमोस्तु नाम शुद्धायो नमो नाम मयाय च नमोस्तु नाम रूपायो नमयस्तु नाम जलपिने नमोस्तु नाम शुद्धायो नमो नाम मयाय च गौरी गोष्ठीपति गौरी गोष्ठीपति शिशिल भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती को स्वामी ठाकुर प्रभुपाद परमहंस जगत गुरु टोल्ड दैट इज द एक्चुअल स्लोगन ऑफ अर गौरी मठ गौरी गोष्ठीपति शिशिल भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती को स्वामी ठाकुर प्रभुपाद परमहंस जगत गुरु टोल्ड That is the actual slogan of Gaudiya Math. Gaudiya Math. Only that we have to worship. Only this slogan is our only worshipable, worshipable uh, object. That is the actual slogan. Definitely, definitely, in our Gaudiya Math, that is the actual slogan in Gaudiya Math. Shri Nam. Just by just by taking Shri Hari Nam, that is actually called bhakti. Just by taking the Hari Nam of Bhagwan with full prem bhav, that is called bhakti. Just to speak Hari Nam of Bhagwan, proper speaking, that is actually called bhakti. Definitely be sure about that. Shri Hari Nam. There is no other alternative of Shri Hari Nam. Shri Hari Nam has no alternative. Those people who are all the time doing one lakh Hari Nam. and they are just taking one lakh hari naam all the all the time for them whatever object is given to them uh, to bhagwan they bhagwan is not at all taking them those who are not taking one lakh hari naam those who are all the time that one lakh hari naam hari naam is not at all doing for them bhagwan is not at all taking uh, anything from their hand bhagwan is not at all accepting those things from their hands bhagwan in purushottam dham in front of all the devotees in just a joking mood they just start bhagwan speaking that i am actually not taking anything from the hands of lakpati apart from lakpati all the devotees actually thinking actually we are all poor i am we are actually not lakpati we are not bhagwan speaking those who are at least doing one lakh hari naam that is called lakpati then bhagwan mahaprabhu has just uh, uh, told all the devotees by himself this point so this hari naam there is no alternative of hari naam all the time those who are doing one lakh hari naam those who are not at all doing one lakh hari naam for them whatever the object they are giving to bhagwan bhagwan will not at all accept them propad propad ji swam speaking this point propad himself speaking this point very important point that bhagwat bhakt bhagwat bhakt jo bhi to whoever he is bhagwat bhakt propad propad is propad is speaking that bhagwat bhakt those who whoever whoever he is whoever he can be bhagwat bhakt whoever bhagwat bhakt is any bhagwat bhakt if he is under guru anugatya all the time he is doing one lakh hari naam he definitely has to do one lakh hari naam that is very good if he do, if he will do that all the every day otherwise different kind of uh, material things he will get uh, attracted to that and he will be unable to do bhagwat seva if these people they can do uh, under guru anugatya they are not doing one lakh hari naam then definitely bhagwan is not at all accepting their objects what they are offering and if any bhagwat bhakt if they are uh, all the day every day one lakh hari naam they are doing under the guidance of uh, guru varg they are not at all doing one lakh hari naam then lot of problems can come 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 in their life definitely they have to do one lakh hari naam otherwise different kind of material things they will get attracted to that and they will just leave bhagwat seva and they will not be 
capable of doing bhagavad seva that's why shri in shri kodiyamat those who are all the the persons who are actually have taken shelter of kodiyamat those who have actually taken shelter of kodiyamat those who are just uh, making a show of uh, uh, shelter i am not speaking of them so those who have already taken the shelter of kodiyamat anyone who is do has to do one lakh hari naam every day he is actually all the time busy in doing one lakh hari naam namacharya gurudev namacharya haridas thakur is also there our guru pad padma is also namacharya he is actually writing books it is actually also manifestation of naam and gun gun all books and all hari katha actually is all hari naam this is all coming in hari naam namacharya guru pad padma namacharya guru pad padma just to give take nishka patanugatte of guru pad padma and with full preeti you are doing serving him without without and you are not at all serving your gurudev like that that you are not at all doing nishka patanugatte of gurudev and uh, just that preeti seva towards your gurudev it is not possible that hari naam will get manifest inside your heart it is not at all possible all the time this kind of thing you just need to be careful about this point proper speaking this point that namacharya yeah, namacharya guru pad padma to to just leave that nishka patanugatte of guru pad padma and just to leave that priti seva of your guru dev hari naam is not at all possible just be careful about this point it is very impos- it is very important to think of this point because different kind of aparad especially naam aparad we have to leave naam aparad just to leave under the guidance of guru anugatya just to uh, this kind of wish you are desiring to have that hari naam to get that hari naam inside your all the time you just need to do hari naam and all the aparad will definitely go away some day we have our we have our ill luck in this we have a very bad luck that why we are not doing hari naam why we are not getting anurag for hari naam our main ill luck is that in order to remove that there is no other pathway open for us only shri naam bhajan is available to us only shri naam bhajan is there otherwise it is not possible that there is other pathway open for us those who are actually all people without any with full of bad luck those people who are having bad luck those who have bad luck that that by they are all the time feeling distress in doing naam sankirtan and they are just uh, just doing the drama of bhajan in front of us for them it is not at all possible to get delivered those who are actually having ill luck and they are actually they are doing the shri naam hari naam that shri naam sankirtan because every bhajan is in naam sankirtan is there all the time that's why proper speaking this point those who are actually having ill luck they are actually doing a bhajan they are not at all uh, they are all the time distressful in doing naam sankirtan and uh, they are just taking the reference of other bhajan and just doing the drama of that bhajan in front of us and and they are just leaving guru vaishnav seva and they are doing bhagavat seva bhagavat paath and naam se naam sankirtan this kind of drama they are showing they are all actually pakhandi they are actually all pakhandi people they are all a fraudster number 1 on their tongue on their tongue no, not at all on their tongue not at all it is possible that actual hari naam hari and hari katha can get manifest especially in this kal this is actually kalikal in this kalikal bhagwan swayam has come in this in this is actually kalikal and especially in this kalikal bhagwan swayam has just got a manifested himself and avatar how to do hari naam sankirtan has just instructed us about that bhagwan swayam has just instructed us about this all the how to do hari naam in this uh, human leela what bhagwan has just done in front of us has just instructed us how to do hari naam and bhagwan has just came and it came himself and instructed us about this 
and if actually someone is actually unable to understand then what we can do for them when then bhukti mukti spriha will be there inside our heart and all anarth will be there inside the heart then there is no vishay of bhakti can produce inside the heart bhakti effect will not be there inside the heart bhakti to get uh, bhakti will not get manifest inside the heart at that time that is the actual effect of bhagavad naam that by this that all those nishthur vyakti that their heart also get transformed and melted every everything i have just proved it from the previous and the coming days like narad ji he is actually a nishthur he has just uh, transformed that nishthur hunter into a vaishnav it's already written in bhagavad gita mahapuran mahaprabhu actually speaking in chaitanya charitamrit about this incident that Narayan Ji Maharaj speaking. That oh hunter, you are previously you were actually uh, Krishna Vimukh. That's why this kind of uh, hinsa was there inside your heart. Jeev hinsa was there. They naturally was there, like that kind of liquids for some times, like water. That water is actually very going in the flow. but in special condition that water is just get transformed into ice so that's why naraj ji maharaj speaking that oh hunter that previously you were not uh, under the anugatya of krishna you were actually you do, you have that khinsa uh, inside your heart it is actually for temporary time so this kind of khinsa pravritti was there inside your heart but now by you are actually just doing hari bhajan so in hari bhajan jeev hansa pravritti it is not at all possible that it will stay inside your heart that whatever you are doing hansa that the actual swarup naturally the swarup of natural function of all the jeevas that is krishna dasya that is your actual dharma permanent dharma nitya dharma so this kind of uh, which kind of this is in the form of example it is just manifested up to that point it is just getting ahead in your life so those who have just taken hari naam uh, those who are taking shelter of hari naam they can't do sinful activities and those who have just taken the shelter of hari naam in a very in a very uh, in a very sh- uh, 100% with 100% sharnagati no kind of any sinful activity can stay in their life it is not at all possible kaam krodh lobo mad machare all these kind of six enemy enemies which are there inside our body in fine form So this kind of behavior, what they are doing, they are actually misusing in order to misuse this for your material benefits. These kind of six enemies, when we are using for the misuse in material benefits, then sinful activities are done. Those who are doing actually Vaishnav seva, Krishna seva, when you are just using it in this seva with serving attitude, then by so slowly by naam naam seva, everything will get you will get rid of this. Um, maybe you can see the Jagai Madhai also. Mahaprabhu has just told that he is so much sinful. Jagai Madhai. Jagai Madhai is so much sinful that even they have taken Jagai Madhai, and Prabhu has just transformed them in such a way that they are also also all the time doing Hari Nam. And uh, with Jagai Madhai also, Mahaprabhu is just swam doing Nam Sankirtan and doing all the dancing and everything with Nam Sankirtan. And Prabhu speaking to Jagai Madhai that if you will not, Prabhu, Prabhu, that they don't do any kind of sinful activities. Uh, do afterwards, uh, whatever sinful activities you have done, I have taken that. And then after that, Nityanand Prabhu Dharma Avatar. he has just uh, he is actually requesting to mahaprabhu that uh, that nityanand prabhu is actually dharma avatar himself by this uh, that vigraha of dharma swayam nityanand prabhu by just uh, remembering him 
ऑल काइंड ऑफ ऑन द पाथवे ऑफ धर्म ऑल द टाइम यू जस्ट डू नाम संकीर्तन बाय टेकिंग शेल्टर ऑफ नित्यानंद प्रभु एवरीथिंग यू विल गेट इन दैट नो वरीज अबाउट दिस भक्ति भगवान दैट इज एक्चुअली हलादिनी एंड संबित शक्ति भक्ति दैट इज द भगवान हलादिनी एंड संबित शक्ति इट इज जस्ट एक्चुअल समरी ऑफ दैट भक्ति इज द एक्चुअल समरी ऑफ हलादिनी एंड संबित शक्ति इट इज द एक्चुअल कम्बिनेशन ऑफ हलादिनी एंड संबित शक्ति दिस इज ऑलरेडी रिटर्न इन सिद्धांत रत्न इट इज रिटर्न इन सिद्धांत रत्न दैट हलादिनी सो भक्ति दैट दिस इज द एक्चुअल वस्तु ऑफ दैट शक्तिमान भगवान भक्ति इज द एक्चुअल ऑब्जेक्ट ऑफ दैट शक्तिमान भगवान बट स्टिल दिस भक्ति इफ यू वॉन्ट इफ समी वॉन्ट्स दिस भक्ति दैट इज द एक्चुअल ऑब्जेक्ट ऑफ शक्तिमान भगवान ऑफ इज होन दिस इज द एक्चुअल प्रॉपर्टी ऑफ ओन भगवान बट इफ समन एक्चुअली वॉन्ट्स भक्ति ही वॉन्ट्स टू गेट भक्ति then definitely he can just get it by uh, via devotees only the bhakti can get you can get to be get it by devotees only we have already seen that the hunter case that jagai madai case and haridas tagore also has done a lot of uh, people delivered by haridas tagore so by this there is no other pathway open for us bhagwan actually is nitya vastu but still in order to just be get bhakti if someone wants bhakti even he will desires to get bhakti then it is only possible via devotees apart from that you know there is the that is the only way to just get bhagavad darshan otherwise it is not possible to get get darshan because that sakshat that kind of bhag in order to get uh, that all those mayavad jeevas actually in a um, straight way it is not at all possible the relationship with krishna why uh, why it is not possible why we cannot get uh, bhakti directly without devotees because that all those mayavad jeevas that direct relationship with krishna it is not at all possible with krishna it is the actual rules that is the actual rules of bhagwan that uh, what that bhakti dhara is there that uh, all those their nitya devotees that they were eternal parshad it is only will be get uh, given and distributed by them those uh, nitya nitya parshads nitya devotees that all his eternal parshad that all those mahajans bhagwan has just uh, are they are just like the medium we are bit via 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 which we they are actually just getting manifested in this material world and the bhakti is just get transferred to the mayavad jeevas that's why it is written in chaitanya charitamrit and that top most independent bhagwan and the top most independent bhagwan he is actually just giving that top most priyojan tatva that bhagwat priyojan tatva that the top most independent was to is bhagwan only and bhagwan is just giving the kripa of that bhagwat priyojan to us it is just getting to us via bhakt uh, in the form of bhakti inside our heart it is just getting uh, uh, transformed our heart is getting transformed and only by just taking the devotee's kripa we can get the kripa of bhagwan that is the actual rules bhagwan that directly will not at all give us give kripa to us and bhagwan will not directly uh, doing keep on uh, on the mayavad jeevs it is not at all possible that's why in chaitanya damrad and shri in bhagavad gita mahapurana also it is written it means that bhakti can only be uh, be gotted by satsang in this prasang it is very important to understand this point that we have seen a lot that bhakti haladini and sambhi shakti it is a combination it is a combination of of both of them haladini shakti in the form of bhakti haladini shakti when bhakti is coming in the form of haladini shakti it is man bhagwan that it is already there in the 
Shaktiman Bhagwan. That is called it is it is called Shakti. And when it is coming outside, it is just manifested outside Bhagwan. Then this Aladini Shakti, this Bhakti is coming outside out of Bhagwan. That this is heavy that it is out of it is coming when it is there inside the Bhagwan, this Haladini Shakti, that is called Shakti at that time. When Bhakti when it is there inside Bhagavan, when it is just manifested outside Bhagavan, then all those devotees that inside the then it comes inside the heart of devotees, then it is called Bhakti. Then that same Swarupa Shakti, Haladini Shakti is yet getting manifested inside the heart of devotees, then it is called Bhakti. It is titled Bhakti. But it means that uh, whatever is there outside uh, the heart of, uh, outside what is manifested outside the Bhagwan, that is just getting manifested in the form of Bhakti. And uh, just by seeing the symptoms of all the Bhakti and the different kind of uh, arrangements and uh, behavior of Bhakti, all kind of bhav and the Anand Swarup Bhagwan, why Bhagwan is called Anand Swarup? When this Bhakti is just getting manifested inside the heart of uh, the devotees and is just get manifested in front of all when it is just getting inside the heart of devotees and just get manifested and it's coming in the form of prem seva and serving attitude then bhagwan becomes more and more happy by seeing that bhagwan actually it is actually giving anand to bhagwan well actually bhagwan is anandamai bhagwan is swayam anandamai but still it is, bhagwan is getting more anand by that that is the actual uh, uh, surprising um, Mahima of Bhakti. If one example I can give, you can just understand. Like, there is in, inside the womb of one mother, one child is there. There is one child in the womb of mother. And this mother actually is just uh, uh, becoming very much uh, feeling anand inside her heart that he has child in her, in her womb that she is actually finding a lot of anand when child is there inside her womb. She is having that anand when that child is there inside her womb. But, but this anand is already there when the child is getting out of her womb out of the and is just coming in this material world. When just, that child is taking birth at that time, that mother is just getting more and more anand inside her heart. She is becoming more and more happy. Why? Because at that time, that direct seva is possible for her to do. He is getting that anand to serve that child. And that uh, mother is feeling more and more anand. So that's why this Haladini Shakti in the form of Bhakti, when it is coming outside and is just manifesting inside the heart of the devotees, then that uh, it is actually coming in order to just provide happiness to the Bhagwan different different kinds of uh, serving attitude and uh, efforts towards uh, serving attitude so what service of bhagwan then bhagwan is getting is getting that more anand in that seva bhagwan is in order to just uh, in order to just uh, uh, get happiness for bhagwan and uh, all the time bhagwan is becoming also anandmay with that so in the same way when the child is just getting birth in this material world then uh, mother is getting more and more anand in that like like a flower in the flower inside the flower there is a honey is there definitely everyone knows that inside flowers that honey is there and this honey inside that is the actual this object honey is the uh, is the object of flower himself her. flower uh, this honey is actually the object of flower only but still but when whatever whatever uh, efforts we will make on in the flower in order to extract honey from the f flower we cannot it is not possible to get uh, honey from the flowers there is only one uh, pathway open for us we just need to depend upon we have to just depend upon madhukar madhukar means honey bees those who are madhu that madhu is there inside the floor but madhu is the actual property of uh, uh, the flowers but we just need to depend upon that madhukar those honey bees we have to depend in order to get that honey in the same manner that bhakti roop that madhukar that honey when it is there inside the heart of the devotees we just need to depend upon devotees 
दिया हाउ इन द फॉर्म ऑफ हरी कथा एंड हरी कीर्तन फ्रॉम द लोटस माउथ ऑफ प्योर गुरु वैष्णव एंड इट इज देयर इनसाइड द हार्ट ऑफ प्योर डिवोटीज एंड वेन दो प्योर डिवोटीज आर दिस जिस कमिंग आउट ऑफ द लोटस माउथ ऑफ द प्योर डिवोटीज एंड कमिंग इन द फॉर्म ऑफ दैट मेल्टेड हरी कथा इन फ्रंट ऑफ अस देन दिस काइंड एक्चुअली इज टेकिंग द फॉर्म ऑफ दैट प्योर भक्ति शुद्ध भक्ति maybe it is just getting manifested inside the heart of uh, the mahajan and is coming in the form of kirtan and hari katha it is just getting uh, imbibed inside our heart then only it is possible there there is one example which i can give like a surya kant this actually exa- example is given in the shastras There is one example in Skanda Puran. The sun, actually, the Surya Dev, the sun god, that the Dahi ka shakti of Surya Dev, that is already there. But uh, that Dahi Dahi ka shakti of Surya is already there when. Surya Kant. When in the childhood we were just used to play Atrash Kant, that lens power. By that lens power we just concentrate on some particular object on paper, and that some dry leaf or some some paper, that dry paper we are just focusing the rays on the on the paper. And in the childhood we used to do Surya Kant means that Surya Kant money, especially the rays of sun. The that is the actual source of the. Uh, shakti of surya sun god just by that only all the fire can get manifested it is possible that we can just manifest fire like the same way in the same way that sadhu sang that we can get a, a bhakti inside our heart it can get manifested there is no other way open for us there is this is the only way like this इफ इन भक्ति भक्ति भक्त एंड भगवान भक्ति एंड भगवान दैट एक्चुअली द स्वरूप भूता भक्ति भक्ति मुझे भक्ति एंड भगवान दैट इज द एक्चुअल स्वरूप शक्ति और भगवान बट वी आर साधु संग संग दैट इज द ओनली मीडियम ओपन फॉर अस इट इज नॉट एट ऑल पॉसिबल टू गेट इट फ्रॉम अदर पैथवे दैट इज वाई महद भक्त संग इज वेरी वेरी रेयर you don't think like that that this kind of sadhu we can find anywhere but it is very very rare to find this kind of shuddha shuddha sadhu that is very impossible but still we can find that by the kripa of shri nitanand prabhu by balram kripa this can be done so this kind of devotee by mahat sang it is very rare very very rare this mahat sang why because bhakti why bhakti is very rare why this harinam actually this you can just uh, uh, learn and speak but without and getting any guru guru kripa and satsang it is not possible to do actual hari naam that's why i am just discussing this point in front of you jagdanand pandit has also written this point a lot of things jagdanand pandit has also written this a lot of things regarding this That's why Sadhu Sang. That is the glorification of Sadhu Sang is there, because Hari Nam, Hari, and those who are doing Hari Nam devotees all the same. They are on the same platform. They are on the same platform. So like this, uh, all those devotees, those who are, they are actually very rare. That's why the in the jivas, this kind of shuddha bhakti. This is very much rare. It is next to impossible to get shuddha bhakti. This kind of shuddha bhakti, by it is just like a medium by which we can get that shuddha bhakti inside our heart. That is very very rare. So this kind of topmost pure devotees, just to get bhakti inside our heart, it is very very rare. That's why in the in the life of jivas, this kind of shuddha bhakti, in order to get that, it is it is very very rare. 
इट इज मेक ऑलमोस्ट टू इम्पॉसिबल टू गेट दैट वाई बिकॉज देर इज वन पॉइंट इज देर दैट दैट साधु इज नॉट अ सर्वेंट ऑफ एनी वन देन एंड वेयर ही इज गोइंग देयर वॉट दैट दे नो द रीजन फ्रॉम इन साइड दैट आई गिव यू वन एग्जाम्पल ऑफ सुखदेव गोस्वामी वाई ही हैज कम देयर टू प्रेक्षित महाराज वाई सुखदेव गोस्वामी इज गोइंग कमिंग टू देयर नो बडी एक्चुअली इज कॉलिंग सुखदेव गोस्वामी देयर नो बडी एक्चुअली कॉलिंग सुखदेव गोस्वामी देयर सुखदेव गोस्वामी इज जस्ट कमिंग टू परीक्षित महाराज मीन्स दैट इन साइड इज द हार्ट ही इज गेटिंग दैट प्रेरणा दैट वाई इज एक्चुअली गोइंग देयर देर इज एक्सटर्नली देर इज नो रीजन फॉर दैट दैट्स वाई भक्त साधु समागम दैट इज मीन्स इन ऑर्डर दिस इज एक्चुअली इम्पॉसिबल वेरी रेयर साधु इज एक्चुअली इंडिपेंडेंट वेयर ही विल गो एंड हाउ इज गोइंग इट इज नॉट द क्वेश्चन नो बडी कैन स्पीक अबाउट दैट दैट साधु दैट प्योर वैष्णव वॉट इज एक्सटर्नली वॉट काइंड ऑफ विच आर लाइक वंशी दस बाबा जी मदर वॉट ही इज डूइंग एक्सटर्नली हाउ इज डूइंग एंड वॉट इज ही इज गोइंग समवेयर हेयर देयर एंड एवरीवेयर इज गोइंग नो बडी नोज अबाउट दैट वॉट ही इज डूइंग नो बडी नोज बट दैट्स वाई दे आर एक्चुअली इंडिपेंडेंट only uh, there is one independence independence which is actually uh, more fallen than the beast that is more uh, dangerous than the beast also this kind of independence and another type of independence is those who are pure guru vaishnav this kind of sweet independence they have i have already discussed this point a lot of time before also they are beyond any rules and regulations why and we are at what time they are doing how they are doing nobody knows about that why they are doing this that particular activity gor kishor das baba ji maharaj whatever uh, arrangement she is doing and what kind of leela is doing bhagwan das baba ji maharaj bamshi das baba ji maharaj bhopad is already taking the role of the acharya and has just shown us in front of us that uh, whatever he has he has just manifested in front of whatever acharan prabhupad has shown actually is paraman shrishta he is prabhupad which means that uh, of all the paramhans is the topmost just be sure about that prabhupad is that paramhans in all the paramhans out of all the paramhans he is the topmost that is prabhupad is topmost but externally he is just by in his own will independently he is taking the leela of acharya he is doing the leela of acharya acharya what he will do definitely all the persons will follow him so that's why willingly he is just showing all the acharan of him that how to do bhajan and gor kishor das baba etc these are also paramhans topmost paramhans is also paramhans shrestha but still he is actually just uh, willingly he is doing this kind of acharan in front of us so we actually couldn't find this kind of thing why he is actually doing this so this hetu shunya so this kind of uh, nishkam devotees this kind this is very rare to find out it is very rare to find all these kind of devotees and if we will find that then definitely we are finding that we have it is we we are finding that but after finding that rare pure devotee also we will not understand him that is the topmost problem in our life after finding that rare sadhu also still we will not able to um, find that what are his qualities maybe we are getting a very good luck that that is a kripa of sadhu that pure vaishnav because that self manifested uh, object uh, we can't uh, force that that i have given one example very previously that there is a very uh, nice handsome boy and he is coming to the chaitanya mart and sometimes he is coming and going like this this is happening and one time what happened he just uh, staying there for some time and is just uh, having that very light bhav inside his heart and some devotees actually thinking definitely one day will come he will just get rectified but after two or four days actually he is going again going and coming then prabhupada actually speaking this point uh, about his own leela he is just giving one example definitely this kind i was actually just going on the field and he is just seen me 
on the field actually i was just seeing the grains and rice what how actually is that uh, is going on for bhagwan seva actually is thinking me material that uh, oh he is uh, sadhu he is thinking pro he is thinking prabhupada and after that he just uh, left oh, he is acharya oh no 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 he is actually all the time in the field and all the time he is busy in material things after that he just went away everything he just left and went away and after that he he just get into a satsang again and and just destroyed his life so if the, we will get sadguru also but it is very rare to just uh, uh, understand them that's why in order to understand sadhu what kind of vichar you need that kind of vichar is not there inside your heart then after that even uh, even if you will meet the sadguru also still you will get uh, empty hand out of from there that's why in narad bhakti sutra already in sandilya bhakti sutra also very beautiful that is written but in narad bhakti sutra it is written there that durlabhu agamyo amagascha mahasangastu mahasanga lekhit that my mahasanga It means the first thing is that that uh, prakrishta sadhu sang is very very rare. Actual sadhu sang. In order to just uh, understand sadhu, still we are getting sadhu, but still we it is impossible to understand them. So difficult it is. If we are getting that rare shuddha devotee, that those who are doing all the nam nam sang is then then we will become full of treasure. But it is very impossible, very rare to get this kind of sadhu. And if we we'll get that also, then we can't understand him. so it is very impossible like condition is there mahasang hari katha this is the only way by which we can get protected hari naam sankirtan mahasang sadhu sang that is the top most thing this which is by hari naam sankirtan that i just want to transform at that is my last uh, target that is krishna prem that is also possible but this is very rare like like the pearls of uh, ne- necklace of pearls is there it is there naturally there in this material world you can find but this kind of pearl where you can where where you can get which is just uh, rare in all the 1 lakh people it is so expensive so rare so this kind of pearl it is very difficult to find how like swathi nakshatra is there that is the star position of the star star position in the constellation definitely if some rain water is there and you have uh, millions and millions of uh, sukti it is already in that one that one water drop will just fall into that and this kind of uh, rare mukti will that pearl will just get produced that has so much so much value it is rare it is already written in chetanya chitamrit about this point that uh, that sakshi gopal that sakshi gopal that you can see the nostrils nostrils there is one uh, hole that rani that queen that uh, king and queen they uh, bhagwan has just came in their dream and just speaking to that uh, queen that you just go and just uh, take this pearl that nose ring you just uh, bring it for bring it for me you can just give it to me bhagwan asking to that queen so this is actually so rare you see that even mil gaj mukta is there one another pearl that this kind of gaj mukta by the some elephant on his head some water is just fallen on his head and after that in every gaj mukta in every in every elephant that gaj mukta will not produce so that is very rare that's why millions and millions of uh, uh, inside the jivas there inside the millions and millions of uh, jivas inside the, that uh, jiva what kind of mahat kripa will just get manifested it is very very impossible next to impossible who knows that it is very very rare and those who are just getting that mahat kripa inside their heart that's why in this whole material earth infinity brahmand you will just uh, go this kind of nishkinchan bhakti man pure devotees this is very difficult to get all these qualities are very difficult to get mahat sang hari katha kirtan both of them both of these things 
are actually called swam self manifested objects mahasang and shri hari katha kirtan whatever is there they are actually they are beyond these three modes of material nature and this is actually very rare to get this next to impossible to get that it is very rare to get these things millions and millions of karmis and all those in chaitanya ji damri at this point is written that millions of karmis inside them there is one gyani that is topmost koti korbe modhe koti korbe modhe hoy ek gyani shreshto koti gyani modhe hoy ek jon mukto matlab it means that that millions of karmis there one gyani is topmost and from millions of all those gyanis one person is those one person can get mukt and from millions of uh, millions and millions of mukt there is one very rare krishna bhakt so you can understand now that in gyan marg by sadhan you can get mukti and you the shastra mukhi agya di or chapter whatever yagya written in the shastra by that and by karma actually you can get heaven and you can get bhukti but that swam self manifested nirguna bhakti hari bhakti it is just impossible this is all actually by millions of sadhan you will do it and you will not get that that is the most rare uh, object you will get that is impossible to get very rare object this is so much impossible to get that whatever is there but still it is possible by week if we if their luck is very good then that good association they are getting and they are just by doing naam sankirtan hari katha by hearing that slowly steadily they even can get out of this material bondage or material nature and the actual present situation of this kalikal and the is there a lot but in bhagavad gita mahapuran it is written about that krita vishu praja rajan kalo vichanti sambhava श्री कर श्री कर भांजन ऋषि इज एक्चुअली स्पीकिंग टू निमी महाराज इन भागवतम दैट व्हेन सत्य तेता द्वापर ऑल एक्चुअली दीज आर व्हेन इन दिस युगस दोस वर लजस लिविंग इन दिस पीपल जी वाज आर लिविंग इन दिस युग दे एक्चुअली वांट टू टेक बर्थ इन कलिकाल दे वांट टू टेक बर्थ इन कलिकाल ऑल दोस जी वाज लिविंग इन दिस युगस
All these shlokas actually Bhagavan speaking, but Bhagavan Shri Krishna is Swayam in the form of devotee, is coming, manifesting himself in front of us. He is Swayam Bhagavan, but he has just taken the form of devotee in front of us. He has just taken the form of Bhakti and Acharya in front of us. In this Kali Yuga, Bhagavan Swayam is just taking the bhava of all the devotees, of the devotees, and is just manifesting himself in this Kali Kal because in Kali Kal Lila Vatar is not there. And Bhagavan actually is coming in Prachanna Roop. And this, uh, the dharma of this Yuga Dharma, the, especially of this Kali Kal, the actual Yuga Dharma of this Kali Kal, is maybe in every yuga you can see that Nam Sankirtan is uh, that is the actual yuga dharma Nam Sankirtan but especially when Bhagavan actually that yuga dharma pravartan that is coincident yuga dharma and Shri, it is Nam Sankirtan is uh, is the actual dharma of this Kali Yuga that Channavatar of Bhagavan Shri Krishna Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, that Channa Vatar of Bhagavan. And at the time of lunar eclipse, he is just taking the lunar eclipse. How actually Bhagavan has just manifested in the form of Harinam. And Bhagavan has just, and, and in Brajalila also, Bhagavan Shri Krishna. That in Brajalila, Shri Krishna Chaitanya. That Bhagavan has also manifested that Prema Bhakti in uh, his Leela, in Krishna Leela, it is already written there. Rupa Goswami Path has written this. That ab- apart from Krishna, there is no other avatar that who can give this hidden, e- even the Lata Gunmar getting that Prema. But that Rupa Goswami Path has just, uh, finally has just told us. That about Gorang Mahabrabhu, that in uh, Pranam Mantra of Gorang Mahabrabhu it is there. In the Pranam Mantra Mahabrabhu it is coming. And Sri Laguru Goswami Pada has written. Swayam he has written this point. Sri Laguru Goswami Pada. Sri Krishna Tivarna Kaha Majjantu Jagat Premni Vijayan Vijayantam Tada Ahoya Sri Krishna Tivarna Mahaprabhu Sri Krishna Tivarna Mahaprabhu His Lotus Lotus Face His own name he is actually donating and in order to deliver this whole material world into Prem Rasa, Prakrit Prem Rasa, that's why Mahaprabhu has just manifested himself in Shri Krishna Chaitanya Mahaprabhu Swarup. Shri Chaitanya Mukhad Girna. The whole material world is just giving that prema, prakrit prema, just the overflow with prema, every whole material world. In Brajlila also Bhagavan has done this, okay, but Swayam in the form of devotees, bhav, bhav of devotees, he is just getting manifested, that Bhagavan is just getting manifested himself in the bhav of devotees, Swayam Krishna at that time in the, in the that's why when Krishna was not there in the form of devotee at uh, the, in that yoke, definitely he just manifested himself in the form of Shri Krishna Jadana Mahaprabhu in this Kali, Kali Yuga. This kind of manifestation is possible in Kali Yuga. And Bhagavan has already told this point. That this Bhagavad Dharma was definitely there in this material world. It was already expressed there. That was actually manifested in this material world. But 
will all this then all the material jeevas it is not really accept acceptable that much that all those material people they don't want to accept those dharma uh, what given by krishna because they can't understand that bhagwan is actually just given the acharan of devotees only then it is possible to understand for those bonded jeevas so so all this vishaya of bhakti krishna also has given this bhagavad dharma krishna has already told about the bhagavad dharma everything but in this whole material world they, but that is not at all popular in that uh, material world because that is the actual uh, dharma of devotees to just to give uh, donation of bhakti bhagwan can definitely give it that is a different point but the bhakti dan the donation of bhakti that is the only right of the devotee bhagwan has given to them they can only give donation of that bhakti to most that's why this bhakti bhav bhagwan without taking uh, that bhakti bhav inside your heart this in this material world it is impossible to preach that it is not at all possible to preach without taking that bhav in the previous leela whatever uh, bhagwan has just uh, whatever the barrier is there because he has not come in the form of the devotees in the previous that there were some impediments or barrier he has just removed that bhagwan swayam has just come swar sarva sadik the topmost that is the akar of all the rasa bhagwan swayam shri krishna he is actually just wants to remove that barriers with the, that the topmost bhav of shrimati radharani bhagwan krishna is just taking and just becoming one that bhava is becoming one with the radharani that krishna is just taking the form of that molten gold and he is just taking the uh, that golden complexion and become golden complexion molten gold now krishna was black now he is becoming like molten gold so now he has just coming in this hidden form in front of us bhagwan is coming in front of us as shri krishna chidananda mahaprabhu in this bhagwan has just taken avirbhav with hari naam himself in this material world mahaprabhu has just getting avirbhav so this is the actual special yug so this special kaliyug says why because in each and every yug bhagwan is at, is coming but this is actually special kaliyug because bhagwan has just taken this crown of yug avatar is definitely there but still this is actually special avatar gauranga avatar we can just remember that point This shloka I have already told previously also. By this shloka, we can understand. We can uh, understand that that especially in this kali kal, Bhagwan has just uh, get manifested Swayam in the form of, and is just getting avatar in the hidden form. Bhagwan is coming himself in this material world, and after getting into this material world, he, at the time of yoga. yoga avatar yoga avatar is taking uh, so for bhagwan is doing naam sankirtan in this avatar and this sangopasha sangopangashta parshadam this uh, shloka this actually this ang means the limbs that nityananda dai to gosai all all are coming in this limbs especially all together bhagwan is just taking it all these anga nityananda prabhu dai to gosai all actually bhagwan is taking these are all the angs the limbs sa anga and upang upang means upang means limbs of the limbs the limbs of the limbs that is called upanga so these limbs of the limbs means upanga that is shiva said sector all devotees are there so so krishna varna disha akshna krishna varna disha akshna No, 
this Krishna Varna actually you see the Krishna is actually doing Varna that by Krishna actually himself is taking the name of Krishna Krishna Chaitanya Mahaprabhu this Bhagavat Naam is all the time there is two names Krishna 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 that is coming on to the tongue I have already told this point that his own name is just taking on the tongue Bhagavan is taking all the time Bhagavan is taking his own name all the time what it's written there that Krishna Varna What does it mean? It means that, that those who are topmost intelligent, those who are having that some intelligence is there inside them. It means those who are actually intelligent, those who are actually intelligent, the devotees, from there that this uh, from their uh, in their mouths these two words Krishna is already getting dancing on their tongue those he, his body is just like molten gold golden complexion this Bhagavan this uh, is actually just by doing Sankirtan it just to glorify him it is only possible by Nam Sankirtan that Sankirtan Pita, the father of Sankirtan, Bhagwan, Shri Krishna Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, whatever you are doing, his worship and yagya, what, what all kind of things you can do, but this Nam Sankirtan, by Nam Sankirtan yagya only, his all uh, worship is possible. He is all worshipable by only Nam Sankirtan. By only Sankirtan yagya only, it is possible to worship. All those intelligent people are just worshipping, uh, worshipping that uh, Krishna Jitanya Mahaprabhu, just by Sankirtan Yagya. That's why Karvajan Muni has spoken to Nimi Maharaj. That this ang, this limb actually means that Nityananda, that Gosai, all actually, they are actually limbs, which I have already told yesterday about this point. That, that Nityananda, Korang Mahaprabhu Nityananda, Advaita Gosai, This all literally all very beautiful Kirtan is there. So it means that Anga means limb means this Nityananda and Advaita Goswami Bhagavan actually come manifesting himself. And uh, limb, uh, limb of the limbs also, Srivas, uh, etc., as devotees. And Astra means that Bhagwan is not at all taking any weapon in his hand. It is actually Channavatar. So in this Kali Yuga, that weapon means that uh, Avidya Nasa Karinam, that is the topmost. This weapon is there. Which is actually destroying the Avidya of this material sansar. That is the actual weapon Bhagwan is using, this Nam Sankirtan that all the avidya can just get destroyed of this material world. And Parshat means Gadadhar, Shri, Swarup, Goswami, Rai, Ramananda, all are actually Parshat. So we have actually seen that that those who are actually intelligent person only they are just going uh, worship of Bhagwan by Nam Sankirtan and especially Bhagwan has already told this point Bhagwan has already told this 
दैट दिस टू गिव ब्रज प्रेम एंड टू डू नाम संकीर्तन ऑल एक्चुअली नाम प्रेम वितरण द डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन ऑफ नाम प्रेम एक्चुअली इट इज नॉट पॉसिबल फॉर अदर्स भगवान हैज जस्ट टोल्ड इन चैतन्य जी तम रिट इज रिटर्न अबाउट दिस दैट विदाउट मी नो बडी हैज द पावर टू डिस्ट्रीब्यूट दिस ब्रज प्रेम हु विल गिव दैट नो बडी इज देयर नो बडी हैज दैट पावर टू गिव ब्रज प्रेम this is actually important special some ram ji ram ji has very less power he can't do it is not like that the vichar is actually that that uh, poon that complete was to everything is complete but that actual manifestation of shakti that can get manifest according that is anukul to the leela like uh, shri ram chandra ji that uh, sita ji is coming with him and with varaha dev lakshmi devi ji is just getting abhirbhav is coming in that form and with nirsingha dev lakshmi devi ji is coming not one lakshmi different different lakshmi sir there that to how so how much shakti is required according to that that shakti man bhagwan that shakti is just getting manifested and taking avatar all the time not uh, with kurum bhagwan there is different shakti varaha ved varaha matsya avatar nirsingha bhagwan shakti is definitely there but it is different shakti so in this kalikal only by naam sankirtan only bhagwan swayam actually he is already written there that swayam bhagwan is the actually is taking the bhav of devotees and just get manifested himself in him that is called the chhanna avatar and naam dham etc by not giving his actual uh, Uh, actually is not given the title of him before coming and only what is that vishesan that is one chhann kalau chhann kalau in kaliyo bhagwan has come in the form of chhann avatar and other other thing is that what does it mean actually how where actually this meaning will be meaningful in mahaprabhu only that by shri naam sankirtan yagya only that shri naam by doing that naam sankirtan yagya that ishwar of the ishwar ishwar eshwar by sankirtan yagya bhagwan shri krishna bhagwan it is possible to worship bhagwan is the only worshipable object by shri naam sankirtan yagya only not by other kind of yagya in this विषय देर इज अ वेरी डीप विचार निगोड़ता निबंधन सुमेधा जेट इज सो मच हिडन एंड सो मच हिडन दैट एक्सटर्नली ऑल दोज मटीरियल जीव एक्चुअली विल बी जस्ट स्पीकिंग फाउल वर्ड्स बिकॉज एक्चुअली दिस इज धाम ऑफ गौरंग महाप्रभु बट इट इज एक्चुअली नादिया डिस्ट्रिक्ट भगवान एक्चुअली निमाई एक्चुअली स्टेइंग इन नादिया डिस्ट्रिक्ट सो बट स्टिल दिस नदिया नंदन दैट इज दिस गौरंग महाप्रभु एक्चुअली अपार्ट फ्रॉम लिविंग दैट दैट लैक्स एंड लैक्स ऑफ पीपल दे आर एक्चुअली गोइंग टू गिव वाटर इन यू सी इन दिस श्रवण मंथ ही लैक्स ऑफ पीपल आर गोइंग टू गिव वाटर टू बाबा बोले बाबा एक्चुअली आई वॉज जस्ट थिंकिंग दैट दे डोंट नो अबाउट गौरंग एट ऑल वॉट इज द मैजिक ऑफ माई आई यू सी इज वेरी सरप्राइजिंग टू हियर दिस पॉइंट दैट दे डोंट नो अबाउट दिस दैट हु इज एक्चुअली गौरंग महाप्रभु एंड इन माई लाइब्रेरी इन फ्रंट ऑफ माई लाइब्रेरी वन पर्सन एक्चुअली स्पीकिंग दैट वेर इज गॉन एक्चुअली आई जस्ट गॉन्ट टू गिव वॉटर अरे वॉट भक्तिनो ठाकुर इज देयर गौरंग महाप्रभु इज देयर गदा दर एवरी वन इज देयर but he is actually not uh, listening to me at all that just by sekriti only he can understand he is actually mad foolish he is just going there and just giving water so what to do this kind of uh, vichar buddhi is there to just get that kind of intelligence top point and it is not at all possible otherwise then you will not get the dust particle from the topmost dust particle from the lotus feet of pure guru vishnu he will not get pure at all what rupa swami bhai has told krishna prema pradayati krishna ay krishna chaitanya namo namo mahavadanna krishna prema 
प्रेम प्रदाय कृष्णाय कृष्ण चैतन्य नाम ने गुरु दिस रूप गोस्वामी पद हेस्ट वर्ल्ड दैट महावदन जो महावदन महावदन मीन्स दैट हु कैन गिव कृष्ण प्रेम हु कैन दैट वेट रेयर रेयर ऑब्जेक्ट दैट कृष्ण प्रेम इन दिस इन्फिनिटी ब्रह्मांड दिस कृष्ण प्रेम हु हैज कम इन द फॉर्म ऑफ कृष्ण चिदन महाप्रभु इन फ्रंट ऑफ अस इन ऑर्डर टू गिव दैट कृष्ण प्रेम टू अस बट स्टिल दोज पर्सन आर नॉट एट ऑल रेडी टू टेक दैट कृष्ण प्रेम दे आर महावदन है महावदन है इज सो मच वदान्य इज देयर सो मच मर्सी इज देयर टॉप मोस्ट मर्सी रेयर दैट सॉरी दैट रेयर भाव this kind of rare bhav it is just that to just to get the top most mangal vishay that is the mahavadan hai badanya means some actually has just given that general thing to us bhiksha but when that badanya is becoming absolute that is only possible in gorang mahaprabhu absolute that absolute badanya that he has just come to give krishna prem to us that krishna actually is just swayam he swayam krishna only is coming in the form of krishna chidan mahaprabhu krishna krishna chidan it is very very rare this kind of prema very rare very rare but still no person we can find who can take that because this kind of what ma gorang mahaprabhu swayam is swayam bhagwan krishna is coming in and taking the bhav of radha rani and also the color of the uh, and the golden complexion of radha rani also he has just uh, taken and has taken the bhav and the uh, kanti of radha rani he has taken and in other avatar it is not at all possible maybe we can get kripa but this kind of thing it is not possible because in each and every avatar bhagwan that shakti of bhagwan is coming but according to the leela the shakti is coming and all the shakti collection of all the infinity shakti in ras leela by naam sankirtan has just manifested that inside that it is a very strange and surprising vishe we can find so we this is actually krishna varnam shaam krishna sang pandarsto parshadam jagai sankirtana prayari jayanti shumedasa and in this especially in this kali yuga bhagwan is just doing this leela so that's why bhagwan is in the hidden form and nobody knows about that that uh, naams by naam sankirtan yagya only that uh, to worship that naam yageshwar it is possible that is the actual vidhan in the shastra by the those who are mukorang mahaprabhu is the naam sankirtan uh, ishwar and only by naam sankirtan only we can worship gorang mahaprabhu that's why sumedha saha this uh, this word actually sumedha saha means that every person nobody every person can understand this point but sumedha saha by this it is actually concluded that each and every person can can understand this word sumedha saha sumedha this word every person can understand and especially in this uh, kaliyuga it is written in kaliyuga special especially in this kaliyuga that by cycle of birth and that in this material world who are all the jeevas actually just taking this material body that uh, for them this is the absolute uh, absolute advantage for them to get this uh, from mahaprabhu that is the top most absolute advantage they can get what is that actual advantage that that what is by that sam sankirtan that we can get top most eternal blissfulness how you can get that eternal blissfulness when bhakti is there inside your heart by this sankirtan by that sankirtan we can get that eternal peacefulness and blissfulness that can just cut our material bondage it means that that in this 
in hidden form. That this Paramam Shanti, what is that Paramam Shanti? Topmost, top, topmost peacefulness, what, it, what is that? That uh, meaning is that the actual result of Nam Sankirtan, it is already written in there. That Param Love and Param Shanti, the top, topmost blissfulness and peacefulness will come. That only by Nam Sankirtan, it is already possible, all, already possible in Sadhu Sangh only. Bhagavan has already told to Autav that what is the topmost uh, advantage in all the advantages. And uh, in the other, in the tenth canto, Bhagavan speaking. It is already written there. So, Bhagavad Bhakti, in order to get that, that is the topmost target. And otherwise, whatever you are just getting in this material world, it is not at all getting that stamp in this material world. Okay, you can get, but by the Shastras, you will not get the uh, Manyata. You will not get the acceptance of the Shastra. If someone is actually getting what kind of advantage they, they want, what kind of advantage they want, the topmost advantageous thing, that is Krishna Bhakti in, in our life. That is the topmost thing. Apart from that, nothing is there. Uttama Bhakti, to get that, that is the topmost advantage. So those normal, those who get that general Bhakti is there, that ordinary Bhakti, just by doing that, when Jeev is just getting into this, he is getting out of the cycle of birth and death. So what about that Baj Praj Prem, that topmost Bhakti, definitely we will get. That's why this all material bondage, to get cut, it is natural to cut the material bondage. That is that is natural to destroy your material bondage. It is de- definitely natural when you get that Braj Prima, that Param Bhakti inside you. So this kind of vichar, if we will do, that Swarup Lakshan, if we will just uh, be understanding that Bhakti Bhakti and Bhagwan, all they are actually Tatatma Bhagwan var on one platform. And by Tathastha Lakshan only, only if we are just understanding the, and we are just uh, understanding Swarup Lakshan, then only we can understand this point. So, this Naam, Roop, Gona, Leela, is actually Naam Sankirtan, that Shri Hari Katha, that nectar is coming from that, the flow of nectar from where it is just coming out. And uh, all uh, actually is coming inside the heart of that uh, uh, bonded jivas and has just uh, glory, uh, have just uh, manifested that uh, Krishna prema inside their heart. That is called Mahasanga. Mahasanga is not that, not uh, so called uh, satsang. They are actually so called satsang is not at all uh, mentioned. Especially it is mentioned about the actual satsang. In Chaitanya is a very hidden tat, hidden siddhant is there. It is important to understand that what is the actual symptom of Mahatvakti, that topmost pure Vishnu, what is the actual symptom. Swayam Bhagavan has just done this Prajalila. And, and Swayam Bhagavan, this Prajalila, in this whole material world is actually in this everyone has just got that uh, donated that uh, prem dhan in the, the brajalila also bhagwan is swayam uh, bhagwan actually getting manifested in this and has given that prem bhakti to everyone but still after that he has just uh, got his tiru bhav lila he just got uh, vanquished from vanquished lila that is he just got the tiru bhav and after that when bhagwan Shri Krishna just got Tirabha. Then, uh, when Bhagavan Shri Krishna just done his Tirabha Lila, this Bhagavan, 
श्री चैतन्य जी तामलेट इज रिटर्न दैट भगवान श्री कृष्ण हैज जस्ट टेकन द फॉर्म ऑफ श्री कृष्ण एवरी थिंग इज इज गिवन बट आफ्टर दैट आफ्टर तिरो जस्ट थिंकिंग दैट दिस ब्रज प्रेम टू गिव टू एवरी वन इट इज नॉट एट ऑल पॉसिबल सो आई डेफिनेटली हैव टू गिव दिस ब्रज प्रेम टू इन दिस विषय भगवान हैज जस्ट मैनिफेस्टेड इज गौर लीला has just taken the avatar of gorang and he has just instructed to each and every material jiva that what is the actual target of our and how to achieve that this we are actually discussing that and the previous shlok which i have already given that seventh number shlok that shikhastakam of the shikhastakam we were discussing that we prelim separation of bhav and that sambhog we have already discussed yesterday and krishna vimukh that nagariya dal all sahajiyas they are actually sahajiyas they don't have this kind of news that where is krishna prem and where to go that they are actually sambhog vad they actually want to enjoy this material things they want to materially enjoy bhagwan and they are actually krishna vimukh but externally they are showing nagariya vad they are gor nagari var this they are actually in this dal so this actually they don't they it is not possible to get krishna bhakti for them because they are sambhogvadi they are actually just our sense gratification they are actually thinking about their sense gratification they are just running for that they are just busy in that gor kishor das baba ji also we also always used to speak that inside their heart that there is a passive calm inside their heart that is passive calm inside their heart if someone actually some devotee actually is that uh, so called devotee actually speaking that uh, in navadvip that rani choda there is one krishna prem uh, brahmar gita is going on that krishna prem is they are distributing that brahmar gada etc they are just reading oh you don't go there baba ji maharaj speaking no no nothing is there so this kind of krishna prem actually is not their work and baba ji me speaking that there is passive calm inside their heart and it just because that they are not getting that uh, that whatever calm is there this kind of vasana is there inside their heart so this is actually just one kind of uh, they are just getting on to the ground this is actually have that prakrit calm inside their heart that's why it is just going on that is called passive calm so externally we can't understand that that is actually called prem naam so these all kind of things these sahajiyas are not at all understanding this point it is not at all possible for them to understand this so gorang gorang the what is the actual uh, uh, hidden rahasya that actual secret of gorang leela that from starting till the end there is actually nourishment of vipralam bhav there is no other bhav there is no other bhav apart from vipralam bhav that is the actual secret of gorang leela that krishna ashrit gorang leela ka rahasya the actual secret of gorang leela is what prabhupad speaking the actual secret of gorang leela is that that to krishna ashray bhav that krishna by his own desire this ashray bhav is just expressing in front of us that is vishay krishna that krishna is just by his own will is that krishna ashray rati bhav we are just getting manifesting it all the time those who are persisted in that vipralambras that uh, in chatanya chitamrit we are just discussing this point this already told in chatanya chitamrit that is the actual summary that bhagwan krishna when just getting uh, tiro bhav leela after that he is thinking that uh, i haven't given this braj prem to anyone so this braj prem is definitely i have to give that and apart from me no nobody can give this kind of braj prem only i have to go again on this material planet and in this yug dharma and then i will be just changing that yug dharma and just be giving naam sankirtan to do in this yug dharma will manifest that because yug dharma is the naam sankirtan anshi is swayam bhagwan only is just 
स्वयं भगवान डोंट नीड टू कम बट स्टिल भगवान हैज कम हिमसेल्फ इन द फॉर्म ऑफ छन्न अवतार टूगेदरनेस ऑफ द युग धर्म एंड भगवान मैनिफेस्टेशन अगेन दिस कलयुग इज जस्ट बी कमिंग टूगेदर अगेन कम्बिनेशन ऑफ दैट इज कमिंग अगेन एंड दैट्स वाई भगवान इज कमिंग इन द फॉर्म ऑफ डिवोटिज आई एम जस्ट टेकिंग द भाव ऑफ ऑल द डिवोटिज आई डेफिनेटली गेट मैनिफेस्ट इन दिस मटीरियल वर्ल्ड अगेन एंड एंड ईच एंड एवरी पर्सन ईच एंड एवरी मटीरियल जीवा आई विल बी डूइंग दैट आचरण बाय नाम हाउ टू डू नाम संकीर्तन एंड हाउ टू फॉलो दिट पद्धति एवरीथिंग आई विल टेल बिकॉज बिकॉज इंडिपेंडेंटली इफ आई विल नॉट बी डूइंग द आचरण then it is impossible to uh, show to others it is only the written i will be just uh, discussing it tomorrow this kind of vishay avadir no koi ka vishnu apni nodiya aisa soch samajh so this is where why bhagwan is just uh, swayam bhagwan is just getting manifested on this material planet as shri krishna chaitanya mahaprabhu kali kali pratham shandai avadir no koi ka vishnu apni nodiya this nadia in this nadia prabhupad actually speaking that uh, the actual hidden uh, secret of this gorang leela that those who, that krishna ashray rati bhav when we are just getting manifested inside our heart this kind of uh, rati is just getting manifested and that uh, some bhog ras uh, the ma- just to get the uh, uh, nourishment of that some bhog ras and that vipralam ras is just getting is just getting pratishtit in that vipralam ras that is the actual uh, thing in order to just show this uh, point practically shri krishna has just taken the vipralam ras avatar he has just taken that krishna jitanya mahaprabhu gaur swarup has just manifested in front of us and in this that some bhogvadi those who are all unstable pratish pratish pratishta is there efforts are there so those sambhogvadis who those who are all uh, destructible sahajiyas are there foolish sahajiyas this kind of all kind of uh, uh, invaluable chesta they have they it can never uh, they cannot uh, hide that actual truth so they are actually just preaching oppositely and the gorang nagri were they are just uh, actually preaching the opposite way so now actually this seventh number shlok and now eighth number shlok will be moving ऑफ शिक्षा अष्टकम बाय द श्लोक दिस शिक्षा अष्टकम वी कैन जस्ट गेट द एक्चुअल इंस्ट्रक्शन वी कैन गेट दैट इन कंप्लीट द बिकॉज ऑल सीक्रेट थिंग्स आर देयर इन साइड दिस महाप्रभु बाय एट नंबर श्लोक व्हाट ही इज एक्चुअली इंस्ट्रक्टिंग अस दैट दिस कृष्ण भक्त फॉर वन कृष्ण भक्त that it falls ego is a very default distant thing even you can can't find even one fault in them mahaprabhu actually speaking mahaprabhu ji is speaking this stock this is very serious discussion actually Ashrishya means that to get alingan, to embrace. Just by your feet, you just kill me, and just by your feet you kill me. And that padam sevan karani, this dasi, you just if you have that desire, if you can just embrace this dasi. At at your chest, you just embrace her, and by your adarshan, you just uh, just uh, taking me at the bank of the death. Whatever you want to do with me, but this lumpat purush, whatever kind of uh, behavior you are doing with me, but whatever kind of behavior you will do uh, in front of me, but for no worries for me, because you are my pranath, no. so this lumpat by this word by this word lumpat you don't think that lumpat actually is of this material world yes i have already told this point that in this prakrit material jagat that lumpat each and every person this is actually very heinous very very dirty 
that the prakate ne la patte is very much we just need to spit on that so much bad oof but that a prakrit jagat that la patte if it is there then that of that a prakrit jagat la patte is there there is only and only that is only satisfaction that is the only the kind of krishna we are actually krishna is the topmost bhukta we are krishna is the topmost enjoyer and nobody is there to enjoy only krishna is the enjoyer the supreme the supreme hero in that in that lampad that's why if we are using that shabd lampad there then we will get the topmost respect because this lampatte we need a prakrit lampatte this kind of sweetness of lampatte we want to taste there actually this word lampad shabd actually this is a topmost respect because i have already told a lot of time that uh, this uh, prag in this prakrit jagat this material world this material world is just a reflection of that transcendental world this prakrit jagat and prakrit jagat this is actually the reflection of that so that in this jagat what is actually very uh, very worst in that jagat it is a topmost respect it that's why you don't think it other way so that lampatte with prema full of prem bhav mahaprabhu actually expressing this point in front of us that we can see that that in krishna karnamrit also that for krishna that kind of attraction that kavi karanpur has just told like amish that meat fish etc it is just compared with that externally we can find that it is very bad what he is speaking it is very bad but but you don't feel bad about this that externally we are feeling why actually is speaking amish why is actually comparing it with meat and fish that what the the persons who are just finding so much ruchi in just taking meat and fish the material persons are finding that anand in that meat and fish if that kind of attraction we are getting on to lotus feet of krishna what mahaprabhu has just uh, told i have already told this point yesterday also that param vyasana nari that there is one wo- one one woman he is actually just doing the drama of that uh, so called uh, ramani he is just taking pati prata ramani she is becoming the pati prata ramani role and inside her heart she is she is actually just having attraction for the other person why mahaprabhu giving this kind of example because this example actually in this material world whatever you will give that is the best example to give apart from that it is not at all possible to give you that understanding because in this material world whatever object is there from uh, starting till the end in this material world whatever examples are there that all are not at all suitable for us in order to just understand that a prakrit jagat no other example there in this prakrit material world which we can understand by that but what to do definitely we have to understand that so that's why near approximation these examples are used and mahaprabhu has just given this example in front of us that is from material uh, world he is just giving this but uh, this actually just given in uh, up front of that krishna prem if we are just uh, getting uh, up front in that krishna prem in that vishay we are just using that in krishna prem that it is a topmost example it means that that ramani he is she is actually just getting attracted towards other persons other if actually is just getting attracted towards krishna that absolute truth if if i am getting that towards absolute then i will also become absolute he will become also absolute so that's why mahaprabhu has just given this example willing full he has given this example so this lampat word actually also this is not a normal ordinary word is that uh, krishna lampat each and every has a, a krishna's adhikar for that krishna is the only in has the adhikar for lampat some jeeva, jeeva are actually according to their desire is just embracing him on the chest so krishna is the only adhikar to do that that's why this kind of confidence mahaprabhu has just shown that bhagwan that krishna is actually is my pranath 
बट ही इज एक्चुअली माई प्राण नाइट एंड आई एम दैट इज द लोटस हीज लोटस फीड इज माई ओनली सपोर्ट सो वॉट एवर काइंड ऑफ बिहेवियर ही विल डू फॉर मी दैट आई एम इट इज एक्सेप्टेबल टू मी बिकॉज ही इज एक्चुअली देयर फॉर मी वॉट एवर काइंड ऑफ बिहेवियर इज डूइंग बट स्टिल ही इज आई डोंट हैव एनी काइंड ऑफ ग्रजिज फॉर दैट बिकॉज ही इज माई प्राण नाथ ही इज माई ओनली प्राण नाथ अपार्ट फ्रॉम प्राण नाथ मीन्स दैट वॉट यू मीन माई प्राण नाथ यू सी महाप्रभु एक्चुअली वन डिवोटी ऑफ महाप्रभु आई वो कांट रिमेम्बर इज नेम लाइक सत्यराज खान ही हैज जस्ट रिटर्न वन बुक श्री कृष्ण विजय वॉट इज द नेम ऑफ बुक आई कांट रिमेम्बर आई थिंक इन दैट बुक ही हैज रिटर्न इन द बंगला प्रयाग इन द बंगला लैंग्वेज ही हैज रिटर्न वन बर्ड It is already in Chaitanya Chaitanya Amrit also. Mahaprabhu was just become so much satisfied with him that he just want to sell him to that Satyaraj Khan. It is written there. This word actually he has used in the book. I am actually just getting selling on to your lotus feet. I am just selling myself to you. What word you have used here? And just for you, I am just selling so much happy Mahaprabhu is getting. and this word when vallabhachare has just uh, by his false ego is writing and uh, speaking in front of uh, mahaprabhu that i have just written the glorification of mahaprabhu mahaprabhu speaking that actually i am foolish i don't know the actual glorification of naam prabhu naam i only know that nanda nandan krishna yashoda nandan krishna is more pranath he is my actual pran i don't want to actually hear apart from that because what i will do to hear i don't have that adhikar so by these all kind of conclusive activities it is actually concluded that those devotees if they are actually just nandan nandan krishna yashoda nandan krishna and radhika pran nath sachi nandan mishra nandan like this they are actually calling him then bhagwan actually just forget everything bhagwan forget everything so much anand bhagwan is getting by that so that's why that is he is my prananath prananath where this word actually this in material world some hero and heroine we are just applying it they are actually all the time using this word they, they will not actually hear this because in their heart it is not at all uh, getting manifested this meaning of prananath that apart from them there is no life and soul apart from them that is called prananath and this pranath actually they are just using here and there hero and heroine so this is not possible at all so this kind of word pranath here and there we cannot use okay by that kirtan bhakti no thakur ji is just actually giving this meaning in bengali i will be just speaking in hindi that uh, this actually by those path seven karani this dasi you just uh, that krishna is just uh, embracing I should embrace her on the chest and uh, darshan without any darshan just uh, be making me just be making me on the verge of death without that giving darshan so what i should do now he is actually lampat where lampat uh, is lampat this word actually there is lot of meaning in depth meaning tomorrow i will tell about that that we pralam baba radharani and he nath like this she is speaking and kashi kashi ma bhujo itadi chacha kal kar etc i will just be discussing tomorrow and this word lampat there is another meaning of that the meaning is that the first thing is that that in those who are doing gaudiya bhajan for them the the top most in depth target what is that those who are doing gaudiya bhajan for them how they can get that krishna prapti what is the actual target to get lot of people are there to get krishna according to their mood and bhajan mood they are just getting krishna in different in different ways but those who are doing gaudiya bhajan that under the anugatya of radha rani that under the anugatya of gorang mahaprabhu 
those who are doing bhajan what is their actual target their actual target is to to get manifest in the manjari swarup just to get uh, discover them inside the manjari bhav that is the very depth uh, in a very fine form in jivatma bhakti no thakur speaking that in fine form very very fine form that jivatma swarup inside them that nitya swarup is already there in hidden form maybe definitely i'll be just talking about that tomorrow but i will be just speaking now one line in front of you so this thing actually is there mahaprabhu the whatever the path is shown by mahaprabhu we are getting that manjari swarup in hidden form why because in this only we will get that maximum profit if they are having that profit and loss account that pro- maximum profit we will get out of that the topmost maximum profit we can get that what mahaprabhu has just shown us and it doesn't mean that each and every jiva will get that because each and every jiva has their specified swarup is there in hidden form bhakti no thakur has just written in jayav dharam that that they have that beautiful swarup eyes everything is there aprakrit inside but it there is in hidden form it is there so this lumpat word actually if i will be just meaning it in full then you can see that there is very in depth uh, meaning in that 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 is the actual natural vritti of krishna that which jivatma will just take a swarup in front of me and will come in front of me like gop kumar has just uh, come in gop swarup with uh, in front of krishna so he has just came in that gop swarup in front of krishna after that when he is going there when gop kumar is actually just went there to golok dham means that he has got that vastu suddhi in that krishna when he is just coming from the uh, all kind of kirtan and going on and he is just coming from the cow work and uh, all the cows this kind of uh, the dust particles of the uh, all all the all dust particles are there in all the four direction and at that time when gop kumar actually running towards krishna in order to catch krishna and krishna actually is just catching them him so all the way at the last he is krishna is just taking him on embracing him on the chest and just started crying dost oh friend why you have taken so much time i was actually just thinking of you for a long time so this kind of thing you see each and every devotee what kind of bhav they are taking in that siddhi they will get that only so this whatever mahaprabhu this vishay has given by mahaprabhu this word lumpat why why it is written there in chatanya jitamrit is written there openly that radha rani that vilap separation the pralam bhav of radha rani is just tasting krishna bhagwan is tasting bhagwan krishna shri krishna jada mahaprabhu is taking that form and what kind of vilap radha rani has done in krishna leela he just want to taste that practically krishna so when you will see that practically that vilap then you can understand that krishna there is gopi this is not a girl so this kind of bhav that krishna is at the top krishna is actually liking that so this vilap of radha rani krishna want to taste that we can just understand this point clearly now that lalita vishaka actually speaking to lalita radha rani that whatever our jawban is there how much for what time it will stay that krishna actually is getting that is liking that that the serving swarup that topmost so topmost serving attitude the extreme point of that that gopi bhav is there so krishna actually is just which gopi in what particular situation i just to embrace that gopi so that's why radha rani actually speaking that you see that actually my life is going my life is going and when krishna will come to me i don't have this kind of because he is lumpat when somebody is embracing someone is somebody is embracing so now actually i can't be able to speak this point i will be just be speaking the point tomorrow and just by giving rest today just forgive me on this point i'll definitely i don't have any time i don't have any uh, time to just speak more namo astu nama rupayo 
नमस्तु नाम जलपिने नमस्तु नामो शुद्धायु नमो नामो मयाय च वांछकल्पतुर्वशी के पासिंद भविष्य पतितान पावन भविष्य भ्यो नमो